School starts in Jefferson County tomorrow and the district wants to assure parents they're ready for anything. They've created a new nurse response team that's going to help law enforcement in the event of an emergency. Reporter Liz Kodalik and photojournalist Nico Goda take us through their first exercise and we want to warn you, you may find parts of this tough to watch as they go through an active shooting drill inside an old elementary school. We have got to be prepared to respond and have the ability to respond. Attention, lockdown. It's a sad reality. Locks, lights, and out of sight. That now this is part of getting ready to go back to class. That's not why I got into education. For the first time, Rhonda Valdez and 30 other Jeffco nurses go through the emotions of watching the tactics behind a worst case scenario so they know when it's safe for them to go in and help. Thinking about active shooter, yeah, I guess that's part of the environment now. After today, she'll be a member of the Jeffco nurse response team, a team that will help police and EMTs in an emergency. We don't get to say no to this. Nobody gets to say no. John McDonald is the executive director of the Department of School Safety for Jeffco. The nurses were chosen uh, by experience and desire to be involved in uh, school safety preparedness. Part of that training is seeing the active shooter response, and as hard as it is, hearing the sounds. Until you hear it, until you hear shots fired, uh, you don't really know how you're going to respond. John says the district focuses on prevention as well, but he says this has become necessary. And we've had enough experience in our district and throughout Colorado and the country that we have to do this. This is part of our work in protecting kids today. Part of the job now. Actually seeing it, I'm like, oh, wow. School nurses working in coordination with first responders. We have to trust that you guys know what you're doing. A team helping each other, making sure students feel safe. I think it is a good bonding, good partnership that they're creating with us to recognize our role, and we are now recognizing theirs. With photojournalist Nico Goda, I'm Liz Kodalik, 9 News. And all of this training is done at the Frank D'Angelo Center for Community Safety in Wheatridge. Right now, there are a little over 30 Jefferson County School District nurses in the new response team, and the district hopes to add more throughout the year.